All right, so these are the last two uh, nuts that I need to get off. Hopefully these last two will be the easiest. That's why I saved them for last anyway. Hmm. Uh -huh. Yeah. Let's see, I'm gonna wanna go. Why does it just feel so loose? Maybe I got the wrong size socket. Yeah, that's right. It's got a little give. These are actually, uh, I wonder if this whole time I've been using the uh, SAE one. They're actually metric, maybe. So I've been using a uh, 5 8 inch, but it looks like uh, 15 millimeters actually the more correct size. So, let's get that on there. I think this one would be easy. So far it's not. Okay. <laughs> Guess I do need the breaker bar. Good to know. Oh yeah, this nonsense again. Stuck in there. Give. Like between there and there, it's just willing to like wobble. <laughs> Alright, so here's the latest problem I'm running into here. So uh, I've got my, my deep uh, socket on there plus the adapter, and then uh, my breaker bar is not a ratchet, so there's only four positions it can go in on. And unfortunately, just the way the nut is positioned, there's not really a good... Uh... Oh, look at that! Magic, it worked, all right. Now let's see if we can break this thing. That's a good sound. <laughs> Man, it's so much play. It's terrible. So I had my 5 8 socket on there, and that had more wiggle room in it. The 15 millimeter here is a little tighter. There's just not enough space between the end of the breaker bar and the ground. All right, so since I do think we got the nut to budge a little bit, I'm going to try just the regular ratchet. See if I can... Yeah, there we go. Excellent. Yeah, I couldn't, I couldn't loosen it anymore with the breaker bar, but the ratchet, I'm all set. Sweet. All right, I think the next step is to break the nut on the other side. And I'll come back and loosen both of these guys. Excellent. Uh, all right. Is this one just kind of loose already? What's that all about? There you go. Okay. 
Yeah. Don't know why exactly, but this one is already kind of loose. Time for the other side. like this slides back Let's see if we can take this thing out now hello so it looks like yeah those aren't those are hardly attached and then here we just kind of slide this guy off its post Sweet! There's our old cat. There's what's left. It's the gasket, so we'll need a new one of these. gasket off okay so I've got my old uh, I've got the old catalytic converter out here um, and I've still got the uh, the two studs attached um, and I've had a tough time so far finding uh, replacement studs um, especially cheaply um, so I'm gonna try to take these out and salvage them maybe um, soak them in some vinegar to get the rust off so um, the hex, uh, the hex head on these studs is a seven millimeter head, um, and then in my socket set, the seven millimeter socket is uh, for the smallest wrench. It's a quarter inch drive, so I have a three eighths inch to quarter inch drive adapter here, and I'm going to start with uh, just my socket wrench. Um, oh yeah, and I also uh, about an hour ago I sprayed this down with some penetrating oil try to loosen it up. So I'm going to try as hard as I can with the, uh, the socket wrench and then if that doesn't work I'll throw the other adapter on there and get the breaker bar and that ought to do it. So here we go. All right. We put both feet on it Dad. I'm going to put one foot and I'm going to try as hard as I can. Oh, that's mine. Let me give it a shot. Okay. It's like on my scooter. There we go. Cool. So that was enough to do it. Alright. We did it. Hopefully the other side goes just as well. Yeah, and then turn it upside down so that you gotta hold onto the nail. And I just drop it? Yeah. Okay. There you go. The head of the nail hits the ground and, and then uh, 
pushes the stud out. Okay. Great. There's um, two more studs connected to the exhaust manifold under there. Dad, we want to get those out too. Dad, Alright, want to say hello? Hello. Who are you? My name is Logan. All right. I helped my dad fix the train dam. Awesome. Thank you, Logan. All right, so, yeah, got a uh, big old breaker bar, <laughs> adapter down to three eighths inch drive, extension, adapter down to a quarter inch, and we got our seven millimeter socket down at the end. All right, so. All right, there we go. So now I think I'm set to give this guy some leverage. All right. So. Go! All right, please don't break stud. There it goes. Yay! All right. Stud number two recovered. Okay. Last one. Is one step at a time. Okay. <laughs> oh gosh. All right. Let's try. Maybe we'll get lucky and just the regular the wrench will work. Nope, not happening. Oh, I think I got it, guys. I think you got it. Yep. I just needed to change my position all along. Here we go, right? Wow, that's so much torque. There it goes. Man, that can't be good. I don't know what that sound means, but I wish it would stop. Yay, stud number four. Woohoo! We did it. There we go. All I have to do is drop it, I think. I'm just gonna let go. Yep, look at that. <laughs>